Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Uh, today I wanted to talk about the Reds and how awful they are right now. Uh, 11 and 15, I guess technically they're still in the playoff race, but boy oh boy, boy, oh boy this is an unwatchable baseball team right now. Basically everybody in the lineup is underperforming. And you know, if this was 162 games, you could sit back and say, just you know, wait until these guys perform up to their averages, but there's not time. Half the season's basically over and it's put up or shut up. Like I mentioned, nobody's performing up to their ability. And worse than that, there's just no life with this team. There's no pizzazz. And, and I know that a lot of the analytical guys don't want to hear about that. But I, I do believe in analytics, but I also believe that a team needs a heartbeat, heartbeat and a personality. And this team just, they haven't found it yet. And it's really bad and boring to watch. And it's this... Not only is this, you know, a, a bad team that's underperforming, they're, they're, they're just not very interesting. And outside of the starting pitching, everybody is just, they're not stepping up. They're not playing well. It's frustrating to watch. Um, they really need to do more damage in St. Louis. They lost three out of four. And there, there are a lot of things to blame. And I mentioned the struggling offense. And I also think a lot of guys in this, there are a lot of guys who have gotten playing time who just aren't very good. Like Travis Jankowski, you know Christian Colon, Josh Van Meter, Philip Irvin. They're, for a team that is all in, they're trotting guys out there who just aren't are fringe major league players. And to me, that's unacceptable. You know, they they went out this off season, they spent money, and we all gave them praise for that, but they didn't really address the depth. And why on God's green earth is um, Aristides Aquino still? you know, on the alternate site. That's ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. 19 home runs last season. And yes, he struggled towards the end, but he's been turned to a pariah. And man, they could use somebody like him in the lineup. I, I don't get it. He's losing out on playing time to guys who are not nearly as good or who don't have the upside as him. Uh, I'm really frustrated about that. And to me that, you know, the roster decisions are one major reason why this team is struggling in addition to guys underperforming. So they don't have much time to get it figured out. They have another opportunity this week against a struggling Brewers ball club. If there was ever a time to turn it around, now is the time against a team like Milwaukee. So I guess we'll just wait and see what happens. And, you know, it just sucks to go out there and waste very good starting pitching. You know, it's just... They're not going to have starting pitching like this probably again anytime soon. You know, Trevor Bauer's a free agent, so... You know, oh yeah, they gotta make a decision on him too because the trade deadline's coming up, and so yeah, just not the season we're expecting, and there's not much time to figure it out, and that's where we sit right now with the 2020 Cincinnati Reds. As anyways, as always, I should say, thank you guys for watching, and I'll talk to you later. Take care. Bye.